atrociously fragrant facade, a legend in his own mind. I was nothing like a legend, rather a waltzing rose beneath a window tinted with uncertainties, or a bedtime story falling unto deaf ears, invisible ink that dries before verse touches page, a seed in tainted soil that sprouts heartbreak, a ghost hidden under bloodshot eyes, and forced half arse polite girl smiles, left the day you decided I wasn't good enough, that's our once fragrant garden, now rancid in deceit, my aura left a bad taste in your mouth, instead of gargling with hope, and inspiration I choked on your acidic, narcissistic, self-centered saliva. You said you were a prick, so I thought I'd be a thorn. Careful of those sharp edges, especially around a woman who's newly scorned. It took far too long to realize that ro rainbows are just an illusion, and that no one believes in fairy tales anymore. Gaslit galaxies thrive between guilt-ridden souvenirs and thirsty dead black roses. You stand, stoic arms crossed in the eye of the storm, cantankerously with the belly of the beast, without a drop of nourishment for parched petals, never-ending sorrow watered with sullen promises of fate. Hopes planted in toxic bullshits that once again sprouted a heartbreak. Suddenly, I draw my first true breath in here's...